that. Oh shit. SpongeBob looks. Oh, okay. He's fine now. He's you know what? Just uh, all this stuff happening around him triggers a little Vietnam flashback. He's not doing too hot. He thinks about those bastards in the trees, but he's happy now. So we don't we don't get, we don't have to worry about a thing. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. In the last episode, we took on Sandy in the Poseidome. We we took on we helped Sandy in her tree dome, and then we uh, finished off the Mermelayer spinning cylinder puzzle in by far record time. In this episode, we're gonna finish out the Mermelayer and see what happens from there. Come here, you piece of shit. There we go. Don't duplicate him, please. And thank you. Wall jump. It oh. Shines. I guess I can't go this way. I did, however, defeat 100 robots as SpongeBob, so that's pretty cool. Keep hitting them, 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 keep hitting them. Just keep hitting them. There you go. Good run back, dude. That was a solid retreat. You definitely escaped me by going three feet in the opposite direction. Hey, buddy. Tell you what, I'm just not gonna bother dealing with you. Make it- make the jump! Or, you know what? Don't make the jump, man. You know what? You do what you want, Spongebob. It's your life. And you gotta live it how you want, man. You can't always listen to what other people tell you to do. You know, sometimes they- sometimes you just have to make the decision for yourself. You have- Now we go up here. And I got a golden spatula. I guess I missed it. I thought I jumped right into it. I was wrong. And then we can do this. The security system. Here is the reward I promised you. You have pressed all the security buttons. Now press the master shutdown button. Okay. What does this do, though? Wait, did I? I thought. I thought those were the security buttons. I'm confused. I didn't it just say I got two of the four security buttons. I don't understand. Okay, whatever. I guess I got it. Although I'm almost certain that those are the security buttons that says two out of four, and I most certainly did not push all of them. But I guess maybe I'm wrong. The rolling ball area. The infamous rolling ball area. All right, tell you what, I'll give I'll give this one right, solid effort, hand. maybe two or three, but I'm not gonna I'm not oh, gonna spend boy. my entire There's time gold here. Gold under that glass, gold I say. My eyes are getting sweaty just looking at it. All you have to do is get that great big ball into that there cup. That's all I gotta do. Ah, oh, easy peasy. How do I get the ball rolling, Mr. Krabs. You start the process by bubble bowling up this ramp to hit that button. Good luck, SpongeBob. My wallet's counting on you. Okay. Step one, we need to analyze. The ball's gonna come over here. We need to hit this with a bubble bowl. Or can we just hit it? No, it needs to be hit with a bubble bowl. So that way it'll align properly. The ball is then gonna go over here. We need to hit this again with a bubble bowl. So that the ball goes into there. Now we wait a second because it's gonna take a second for that to launch. It's going to launch and bring it somewhere. Brings it up to that one, I'm assuming. It brings it up to that one. And what does this button do? Okay, so then that brings that down. So it's gonna go around here, around there. And then we will move over to this track in an attempt to do what? We need to come over here, step on this button so it rolls across there. And then we need to very quickly roll here, do a bubble bowl there so it raises up the hammer. And then from there, it's all a balancing game to make sure we get it to where it needs to go. I think. And then do we need to do something with this? Do we need to hit this? No? Don't think so? Okay. Okay. So let's give this a shot. Let's see if we can do this. Step one. 
We unleash the ball. Then we go over here. Buck. What? Okay, there we go. That is that. Then we go ahead and take this. We can do this right now because there should still be enough time. We move on to step three. Skip. Scoop was successful. So, and then from here, we bubble bull this fucking... Come on, make it, make it, make it. Oh, wait, shit. I think I did it too early. I did it significantly too early. Do it now. Do it now? Do it now? Come on, make it, make it, make it. There we go. It should be fine. That should work. Then we can move on over here. Initiate step three. We let it go across here. And then, boom. Now from there, we need to get to here. Piece of shit. Hit the hammer. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. It smells like victory. There we go. All right, over, over, over. No, 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 not through there! was so close. It's a solid effort, though. It's a solid first attempt. Almost got it. Like a new spot. We just fell. We just fell a little bit short, but it's okay. We're gonna be all right. We're gonna hit it again. <gasps> Shit! No! Did it catch it? No! Come on! It didn't, but it did. Right? It did. No, it made it. What are you talking about? The balls? It made it. What do you mean? All right, well, you know what? I tried it. I did. I did try it. It didn't work. I did what I could. I'll... I don't know. Maybe I'll try it again later. Maybe I'll make a screw yeah, shorts out of it. I don't know. But let's let's keep it moving. Now I'm back uh, here. Do I talk to you? How do I get out of here? Well, that depends. Do you want the booby-trapped or the non-booby-trapped exit? Non-booby-trapped, please. Then go that way. Oh. Or maybe it was that way. Sorry, buddy. You're on your own. Security system has been shut down, and we got a good checkup. Hooray for justice in all its multi-splendor glory! Yeah. Well, Justice Boy, you also cut the power to the Mermelayer's BCS. That's villain containment system. Is that bad? Does Mermaid Man smell like sour milk? Yes. Yes, I do. Oh, no. It looks like one of the villains is broken free. What's that? An evil doer on the loose? Who is it? Man Ray? The atomic oh, flounder? Oh. The dirty bubble? No, worse than that. He's your arch enemy. Prawn. Prawn! Did someone call? Oh, I thought maybe I was looking at superheroes. But now I see it's just a couple of pieces of now driftwood. <sighs> Prawn! I'll never forgive you, you madman! What did Prawn do? The worst thing you can imagine. He put all of Mermaid Man's white clothes in the washer with a red sock. Everything I own turned pink! Pink! How horrible! Personally, I thought pink made you very pretty. Really? Sure, pretty stupid. <laughs> you son of a bitch! What is that yellow thing? Some kind of mold? I'm not mold, I'm a sponge! There's a cellular difference. A cellular difference! Yeah, yeah, thanks for the lesson, Dr. Science. See you later, Pinky! By the seven seas, Prawn, I shall not rest until you are captured! But first, I shall have to change from my secret identity into Mermaid Man! You don't have a secret identity, you old coot. Maybe you better take care of Prawn while I take care of this. I shall avenge you, Mermaid Man! I gotta say, Barnacle Boy's nose jiggle physics are mesmerizing. Ow, fuck. Okay, coming your way, asshole. Here we go! Shit, here we go! 
shit. Here, okay. You know what? That's fine. We'll do it. We'll give it another shot. I feel like a new sponge. Okay, okay, all right. This time we got it. Motherfucker. There we go. Oh shit, easy, easy, homeboy. Come on, take it. Take it down a notch. You just met the Sponginator. Where you at? There we go. Oh shit. Easy. It's getting a little bit close for comfort. Okay, all right, come on. Make it easy. There we go. You're done, bro. Game over. Thanks, Mermaid Man. There we go. Easy peasy. That makes 31, and we need 45, I believe, to move on to the next section. We need 40. Now, that's not actually as bad. We're gonna do Rock Bottom. And then I don't know, I think I might just do uh, Sand Mountain on my own. There's a pair of golden underpants right here. Damn right. Okay, so Sand Mountain I might do on my own time. I'm not 100% sure, but Rock Bottom we will do. Welcome to the dark depths of Rock Bottom. Home of strange creatures and souvenir t-shirts. Oh, sweet. Oh no, it's a robot that makes you piss your pants. Oh, SpongeBob, I'm actually glad you're here. Believe it or not. I'm glad I don't. I'm here too, Mrs. Puff. The robots have stolen priceless artwork from the museum. If you can return it all to me, I'll reward you with a golden spatula. Why do you want all that artwork? Don't ask questions you aren't prepared to handle the answer to. Consider the artwork. That's good life saved, advice. Mrs. Puff. Remember this. This world freaked the shit out of me for some reason. That's a cute little Easter egg. I like that. That's nice. Okay. This is a sleepy time robot. SpongeBob must sneak carefully when near him or he will wake. Got it. Or push LT to sneak, which is actually a much better idea. Because, see, if you run, then he don't like that. Time so you should sneak up a little bit. Sneak. Just a little sleepy sneak. A little sleepy sneak. Just a little, oh shit, easy, 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 go fuck yourself. Just like that. I always used to, like, try to avoid those. I think I went through this entire world without even, like, killing one of those. At least not the proper way. I would just, um, I would just keep running at them and keep trying to hit them. But you know what? Screw your sneaking. I'm just gonna... Sneaking is for nerds, dude. Oh shit. Well, that's what I get for not sneak. 
I gotta say, Bubble cool. Buddy, for a bubble, you really get around. SpongeBob, the robots are plundering Rock Bottom's museum, but they've broken the roadway leading up there. You'll have to be clever and find another route to get in. What if I lick all these stamps and mail myself? Could work, a good move. But perhaps being sneaky would be faster. Yeah, but then I don't get to lick the stamps, Bubble Buddy, and frankly, I was really hoping to be able to do that. Bit. Oh, shit. I missed. Bitch. Oh, shit. Okay, we're good. I made it. Okay. Cool. Shit. How do I get a... When I find a way over there... Okay, I didn't think that would work. Are you sticking your tongue out at me, asshole? Oh, no, you just like that. That's just your- that's just your face. Okay, I see. Uh, no harm done. Barnacle boy! Are you on patrol down here? No, this is my second job. I, I work security. Now listen, if you want to reach the Golden Spatula, you need to shut off the museum's security system. You have to iron those pants or are they wrinkle-free? Unlike you. Pay attention. Ouch! This is serious stuff. Now, if we don't get this robot thing resolved, Shady Shoals will shut down and I'll have to move back in with my son and his wife and his four screaming kids. Now, you see that vent on the other side of the museum? Yes, sir! That's where you exit the museum. Good luck, kid! I won't let you down, Barnacle Boy! I might let you down, Barnacle Boy, but we'll see what happens. Uh... There we go. One down. Now, can I like? Ah, oh shit! Like Almost the fell off. Bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. Uh. Shit. Is that always there? Okay, no, it does go away. Ah. Uh, shit, 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 shit! Oh, God! Somehow I managed. Okay, cool. SpongeBob is presented at the Rock Bottom Museum, which I feel like is more of an accomplishment than he notices. Ah! Ow! Ow! No! Wait! Stop! Stop! This isn't fair! Ah, oh, come on! God. Got it. What? Those robots just appear out of nowhere. Okay, then maybe from here, can I hit that one? They really, they literally just appear out of nowhere. Okay. Hey, whatever, man. Guess I'm not down there, so I don't really care. Are those wax figures, or are they literally just in there? I'm gonna hope they're wax figures. Nice shot, ass. Okay, well, you know what? I get. I was gonna say nice shot, but I missed too, so, uh... Guess I can't really fucking talk. I could go get that sock, but I'm not gonna do- oh. Now Sandy just gets to go all the way across, huh? Wow. Was that the Trench of Advanced Darkness? Oh, it's a jellyfish that's moon walking, moon floating, moon swimming. Hey, Gary. Pick pick whatever one of those is correct. Walk, aren't you? Wow. The trench of advanced darkness, huh? Sounds dark. Okay, Gary, I'll be extra, extra, extra careful. Thanks, buddy. Love you. Or we can just let Sandy deal with all of it. That sounds like a good idea. Okay. Thank you. Oh, shit. Hey, Mr. Bomb. Well, I suppose it'll make Patrick happy. 
I was not supposed to be Sandy, I was supposed to be Spongebob. Take that! No, no, come on, dude, seriously! Oh, 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 wait, we can save this, we can climb back up! No, no. Oh, shit. Uh. Oh. Okay. Well. I guess it's at about an hour anyway, so, uh... Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. I, I do hope you enjoyed. I guess say, the ending of the game is that Sandy gets trapped in the trench of advanced darkness forever and slowly loses her mind, uh, which is super cool. You can leave a like or a dislike, but if you leave a dislike, leave criticism because it'll really help me improve. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and figure this situation out. So, as always, enjoy the rest of your day.